Them City SNES really did just have like an awesome soundtrack. Just the Sim City SNES. Hello, everyone. Ugh, I have. Hello, I have overslept today. I was like, it was like 10 or 11 ish o'clock. I was just like, I'm a little tired. I'm going to take a quick nap. And then it was 2, and I wanted to start streaming by like 1.30. <laughs> so, oops. So, Shay, here's the question. Since this is like my first house flipper strip, it, or wow, house flipper stream in like a while, should I turn on media requests again since that's what I did the last time? I have no idea if it'll work and I forgot how to like set it up. Like, my stream UI should still have it up. I'll turn it on. Let's see what happens. I should put up a t test thing. I did change it a bit, so now I have to manually approve everything I like put in. So I won't get another thing like the boobs incident. That will never happen again. It will, however, uh, test the freaking. You, you never scrolled down my stream and noticed Pharaoh down there? Yeah, Pharaoh's great. We really love you, Gyo GX. I'm gonna quickly grab like something from my liked videos and see like if I can or let's see how well media request works. That's what I'm trying to say. Hello! Alright. Now it's showing me. on stream. Have you ever wanted movies free? It doesn't download look like it is. Free at moviefree .com. If you don't want to download Freeze Movie, then die. You must die. Uh huh. You're you're hearing it, which. Oh, hold on. Show on stream. That didn't do anything. It's explicitly playing like, Hey, this is how you set up stream elements of video requests, and it's not even playing on stream. Well, audio can at least work. I, can, I have a view of my entire queue of things. So, I can at least, like, sh do that. I can do audio only uh, and whatnot. How do I clear the queue? Ah, eh, fuck it. Fuck it! I'm putting it on again. This will clear the queue. Hello, it's me. Have you ever wanted Oh wait, no, there it is. Download movies free at moviefree.com. If you don't want to download Yay! It works. Now it works. Swag. <laughs> Turn it up a bit, that seemed very quiet. I'm putting it on again, by the way. Just because I want to test the up. It's me! A little Have too you loud. Ever wanted movies free? Download movies free at moviefree.com. If you don't want to download Freeze Movie, then die. It works! <laughs> die. Okay, and I manually prove everything that goes on. So it should all be good, it should all be great, 
Let's start this game. Wait, is my page YouTuber on? There it is. How do you add stuff to the queue even? Uh, that should be done through donations. By typing exclamation point donate. I think I have it that literally like any th amount donated, like $1 will freaking get something to play. Uh, you may notice that I may be doing this because I'm low on money right now. <laughs> freaking Twitch payout didn't happen this week or this month. I was off by like three dollars for the minimum amount, and that like so sad. <laughs> and also, then fucking like when we were out to get like lunch for everyone, it double charged. So how the hell do I only have seventy two followers? That's what I'm saying. How come my freaking PNG tuber isn't bouncing when I talk? I've been having so much audio issues lately. Microphone settings. Oh my god, why is the text so ungodly small? I think this is the microphone. This is the microphone. Hell yeah. <laughs> Well, I know now, guaranteed next month, I'm getting a Twitch payout. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Shimmy over here with the fucking 10 gifts. I went from like $3, I think it was actually only $1 behind because I remember uh, after I got the news, my roommate... Uh, messaged me with a freaking extra sub. So now I'm like $75 I think is what my next payout is going to be. Hell yeah. <laughs> Which might be really good because I'm not sure how often I'm going to be able to stream in August. I might be uh, visiting California in August just to freaking uh, check up on things back there. When do payouts come? Uh, middle of the month, like the 12th to 15th is the usual common range for it. Anyway, it's been a freaking long ass time since I last played this. It needs some fucking music. So. Get the Mario Paint OST up. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Amazon payouts really do just be whenever Bezos wants. I should fix the positioning of the fucking this message. What? What? Oh god! What it? <laughs> Can I grab like that little plankton? Can make him like even smaller. There we go. I'm power washing and cleaning. I should be playing the Mario Sunshine. Doggy. I don't remember Odie, not gonna lie. I remember my rabbit. Why is Mini Majima at the top of my stream? Uh, that's Plankton from SpongeBob. Where's my rabbit? Where's my bunny rabbit? Where the hell is my fucking rabbit? Bunny!
Did they change what the robot looks like? <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> Hold up. What did they change in this game? Disable pet needs? Yeah. <laughs> Here's the thing, I don't think you're gonna be able to take care of the pets that often, so oops. I should get two bunnies named them Beat Bug and Psycho Nugget, but that's the, that's Lythero's thing. I can't steal Lythero's rabbits and put them in my game. That's kidnapping. Where the hell is, like, the thing that lets you see what your character looks like? I guess it's just gone. <laughs> I forget where it is. No, it's just a pl bunny playdate, it's fine. Ooh, oh, the bunny! So, for people who haven't seen this last time, and I don't blame it, it was a long time ago I last played this. Here's the gaming room, where I have, like, album arts that I've made on the wall. I should definitely start putting more of these up here, because I've definitely made more since this. We got ourselves a nice kitchen. Living room space. Bunny house. The bunny. Where's the Funko Pop gallery? I have a plushie gallery instead, because plushies are cooler. Uh, I have this awesome Ding and Rampa poster. We're going to, like, leave this here. Everyone gets to admire it. Everyone's admired it. Swag. Here's the bunker. This is where we keep her contained. I remember making this. I was like really drunk and sleep deprived and wanted to make a SNES cartridge. And I got the colors of the pride flag wrong. <laughs> like they're in the wrong order. So that's on me. <laughs> so there's the history of that one, by the way. Uh, there I am with a gun. I do not own gun license. There's me in the jar. There's a bunny. There's Bean Golan. Uh, there's an incident I wasn't related to. That's the Bungo Pride flag? Yeah! Uh, this is where she's contained. She's safe in there. We are safe while she's in there, at least. In case she escapes, uh, we're armed to the teeth. The bungling gay sex bunker. Here's my gamer setup. Why do I have a saw maze in my house? <laughs> it's to keep bungling contained. Bunny! Uh, I have this restroom. As you'll notice, the walls are made entirely of Malachite. It's completely safe, trust me. And here's the bedroom. And here's the laptop. This is where I get work from. I have mail? From Ebenezer Scrooge? <laughs> you like the Sandshrew True Trains pride flag? Oh yeah, this is freaking... It's a really good picture. Hold on. Ebenezer fucking Scrooge is fucking messaging me. Good Christ, close the door. Okay, now I have to do what Ebenezer Scrooge tells me. Yo, know, friend, every year my boss likes to organize a Christmas party for my employees. Now that he's retired, I want to continue the tradition to help uh, prepare in the house. I bought it cheaply from an old couple that moved closer to the relatives. It only needs a little refreshing. Please move the bathroom downstairs so the guests can access it. Oh, and don't forget to leave space for the uh, by the piano so we can dance and sing Christmas carols. Truly yours, Ebenezer Scrooge. Merry Christmas, everyone! <laughs> Hold on. For this mission, because it's so Christmas-themed, I'm getting a different soundtrack.
They get like some winter sounding video game music. Yes, I can. Oh, yeah. It truly is Christmas in July. Yeah, this is how you clean snow, by the way. You can just... You don't have to move the snow anywhere. Once you do your second scoop, it's just gone. Any more snow piles? Hey, change, change, Greg. Hey, change, 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 Greg. Everything's on sale at Christmas in July. Hey, change, 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 Greg. All right, what am I doing here? Remove trash? What trash? That's trash. Why did they change what the robot looks like so much? <laughs> Dude, this, <laughs> the robot I play has been going through some shit. We're out the entire house. I should also be in my freaking Discord room in case people want to join me. <laughs> the new one has colors! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Let's fucking go! There's no way that I'm gonna get fucking copyright strike for this, right? There's no way there's too much shit happening over it! Yeah! <laughs> penis, 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 Yeah! Oh god, I'm so glad we finally get to see it! I've been waiting! I've been waiting! <laughs> this is a fucking classic! Here's me! Oh shit, the donation is louder than you! I purposely made... I purposely made this donation super loud just to be worth the $100. <laughs> oh, awesome. Christmas in July. Uh, I, I, you couldn't even hear the sound effect I was playing because I came in here and I played. <laughs> I couldn't hear that time because I got cut off. Awesome. Mm. Anyway, hello everybody. I'm here. What's good? What's cooking? Oh god, so much of like the folder for PNG tubers is taken up by the Fin Fin thing. <laughs> Oh yeah, the best uh, PNG tuber fin fin. It was a really good fin fin. <laughs> hey, it's me. Hi, hello. I think literally that one donation covered like the overcharge and the Twitch payout. Not gonna lie. Nice. <laughs> like I think it was literally behind like eighty dollars. That's a hundred dollars. <laughs> You didn't think you'd laugh so hard at Mighty Morphing Pingus Rangers? I'm always happy to provide. <laughs> Mighty Morphing Pingus Rangers is so fucking good. Uh, maybe one day they'll make it canon. Balls in your court has, bro. It's like, that video's like 14, 15 years old at this point, right? <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah, probably. It's, it's from the vintage era of YouTube poop. And An surely... An era not seen before since by man or beast in at least a couple of years <laughs> if it gets like copyright striked i'm actually gonna be so sad <laughs> hopefully it doesn't i mean if it's still on youtube it should be fine right yeah i just know that freaking the dude who owns the copyright for power rangers is like kind of uh things i won't say in case he like ever listens to this <laughs> yeah, yeah it's very funny how the chances of talking shit about somebody and them hearing it is like Pretty low, but never zero. I'm usually glad to talk shit on people. Because, like, who, how the hell are you gonna hear me? This dude will probably, like, look for people talking shit just to sue them. <laughs> well, you gotta do something with your day to day, I guess. <laughs> Little I know, someone was in her chat the whole time. No! Yeah. Hey, if you are in that chat, send me a send me a morpher, you coward. Make one of the cool ones, and not one of the lame ones. <laughs> if you send me that fucking stupid ninja steel shit, I'll throw it back in your face. 
What does it want me to sell? These? No? <laughs> this? Alright. Uh, three more things to sell in here. Chandelier of bulbs. Got it. Don't don't do that to me! I'll cry! Don't save me the sunglasses from Jungle Fury! Okay. Speaking of sunglasses, does anyone know what that one video of like just sunglasses rotating with a fucking like song playing over it is? It's like pictures no. of sunglasses. I want to find that video so bad and turn it into a donation, but I don't remember what it's called. I know at one point I kind of want to have one of the dumb Channel 4 rewards I have on my stream just be the fucking uh, Bionicle like break core thing from fucking um, that that shit post Bionicle channel. Oh. It's so good. It's my favorite video of all time, I think. That's New called, from though. Bionicle. Yeah, it's so fucking good. Oglin has hit the gritty. A rabbit is streaming in Lego City. <laughs> Build the bungling stream setup. A rabbit is streaming in Lego City. Feed her carrots. Hey! Oh, this is some Ebenezer Scrooge ass setup here. Hell Can I sell yeah. this? No. What if I just sold everything and left? <laughs> We're not playing Thief Simulator. We could be. You don't know. Nobody knows. Get rid of these curtains. Get rid of this. We're getting rid of everything here. Why well, can't I get rid of these curtains? There we go. Just throw it into the garbage. Into the trash. Still dirt in here? Where? Dirt. No more dirt. Dirt removed from this mortal coil. What's your favorite moment from Pingus Rangers once and always? Um, when they brought in um, fucking Doctor Rabbit in, I, I cried. I cry every time. You have to, you have to take up the mantle after. Um, I. I, I <laughs> I have a bit, but I, I, I don't know where I'm going with it. I'm just okay. I'm going aimlessly with it. Just keep going with it. <laughs> um, fuck. When they, when they, uh, when they traded Morshu in for him, yeah, that, that, that got me. I had to replace him because Morshu's actor passed away. There we go. They completed. Now, hold on. I'm actually curious. Did Morshu's actual actor pass away? <laughs> no. Thank God. This I'd a, be so a, devastated. This is like a this is a joke about um not a joke but just a reference to fucking what happened to um what's his name um the guy behind Tommy. Ah. Uh. I mean to make fun of it. It's just. Hmm. Really? I never saw Once and Always. I still haven't. <laughs> I haven't seen like much stuff from like. No, that's not true. I saw a fucking what's it called recently. I, I not saw. I read. The uh, the uh, Power Rangers comics, which are actually pretty good, they're pretty pretty good. Yeah, I hear like a lot of uh, Power Ranger like comics and like the fighting game are really good. Yeah, the fighting game is pretty good. Um, sadly, people just kind of dropped it because the company behind it is just now big into NFTs and crypto, and people are just oh, like, oh no. Yeah, it's so that's, sad. That's a fucking bummer. It's really lame, actually. Um, I don't know why I there think was, the like... uh, the designs they have for like the original designs they have in um, fucking the comics are actually really fucking good. Actually, <laughs> they're surprisingly good. Like um, just even for like uh, the TMNT crossover and shit, because that design for like all the all the turtles was mad good. <clears throat> First Cosmic Fury now NFTs. Yeah, it, it'd really be like that. I don't think they're actually the same company. But I know that um, it's it's the company that made the game itself. But Battle Flipper is pretty cool. Um, I didn't really play a lot of it. I kind of wish I'd gotten in a little bit earlier and played a little bit more. But it is what it is. Um, I, didn't really, I didn't know who I wanted to play, though. I don't want to play Ryu because he has like normal inputs because it's just simplified inputs for that game, which is interesting and weird. But 
I think it's nice what it is. Um, I just, I'm, I'm chuckling at Lord Draken again because that's a goofy ass design, but I like it. It's so silly. Just combine these two forms into one. Oh yeah, they want me to make so much of this room have like white. I don't like yeah. making rooms just a solid white. I'm making the curtains blue. Oh yeah, we'll just make make the room look so bland and banal like you're in an American household. Let's go we in there. I mean, this is Ebenezer Scrooge's fucking house, so it would be bland you know as what? fuck. Good point, well made. <laughs> Oh, this isn't a pure white bed. I made the right choice. And you can make it different um, colors. Let's go. I'm making it blue. It's a cool looking bed. Definitely was pretty good. I found Udana and Catman pretty fun to play together. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, I didn't know I really wanted to play that much. I know I think I wanted to play a lot of Ryu, but I don't know who else I was really looking at. In the game. On the roster. I think I wanted to play a little bit of um, Gokai Yellow, but didn't play a whole lot of the game. Your lamp will be blue. And it will have your Bunny Wabbit. Your, your lamp will be blue, your oil will be red, your rope, silver. The three Pokemon games I played as a kid. Red, blue, and silver. Honestly, pretty good games. Pretty alright games. Silver being probably the best one on there. <laughs> I probably would have. I think I might have played, uh, looked at RJ a little bit. I know I, I, I saw that he had Shinsho and my brain, like, lit up and I was like, oh, fuck. That's pretty cool. Um... I was also looking at Luna. I don't remember like anything of what I was playing last time I looked at this game. Fuck the green sword. There's so much. Got ourselves a shell. I think I like started with Crystal when I played Pokemon, and then I got like Ruby and Sapphire and Emerald, and the rest is history. I remember I used to have a copy of Pokemon Crystal. And then, like, my sister traded it away for something. I don't even remember what. Oh, no. This was have my ancient history my at this point. Like, I have a couple of my old childhood games, like, in my room. I have my old copy of um, Stadium 2. I have my, like, childhood N64 and shit. I still have my childhood N64. I'm, like, my first copy of Mario 64. Let's go. I even have, like, the... I <laughs> The uh, gold casing for Majora's Mask still. I have that Ooh. original copy. That's pretty based. I didn't have a lot of games from N64, looking back. A lot of the games I ever like, just Pokemon. Like, I, I was a Hey You Pikachu owner. And uh, that game is stanky. It's not great. I've been thinking of having, like, a thing to start my streams with, of just doing, like, Hey You Pikachu or a uh, Pokemon channel the, for, like, the first, like, 30 minutes of my streams. That could be fun, yeah. There's a bunch of PS- You have a bunch of PS3s lying around? Oh yeah, that's right. I think you were doing something with a bunch of PS3s? Was that you or somebody else? Oh, these are going up here. Decorative scales. These go uh, here. Yeah. Just so no, just so he can wake up and understand the weight of his sins. Uh, I still want a fucking common rider fighting game so bad. Thanks, Squirtle. Please. I I need a crumb of fucking build comboing into like shit with my man. I I need it. I need it. <sighs> but sadly, I think all I'm gonna get from fucking Kamen Rider is probably just a bunch of, um, arena fighters, which aren't bad, but I, I, I want a fucking, like, traditional fighting game so bad. 
And then they just had <clears throat> instead of all that, they make a battle royale. They they get added to Fortnite. You know what? I would be down for that because it means more people would be introduced to Common Rider, and maybe we can get like a good one for a change instead of something bad. Yeah, no, there's a bunch of them. There, I saw like a couple videos of them. Those old uh, Kamen Rider fighters on the PS1. Those are just kind of sick. This is the one for um, Kabuto. That one was mad cool. Um, but honestly, if, if they put any Kamen Rider in Fortnite, I hope it's just build. It would be cool, but they're probably going to put in Geats because Geats is kind of Battle Royale. Or just any other Battle Royale writers. There's a bunch of them. <laughs> Speaking of... Um, Battle Royales and shit. Remember the fucking JoJo Battle Royale? Is that even out yet? What? Yeah. Let me see. What was it called again? Last Survivor. I have no yeah, idea what you're talking out. about. It's an arcade game. Okay. And it's a, it's a 3D third person Battle Royale. Okay, it's an arcade. Okay. Interesting roster, which is just part three, four, and five, and that's it, I think. No, Weather Report and Jolene are there, so it's six there, too. So you can play that's as Girl weird, Boss? Yeah. Sure can. You can play as Girl girl Boss, you can play as a uh, little Gaslight Gatekeep, you can't keep Diavolo. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it looks like it only stand users. Jotaro, Kakuin, Polnareff, Dio. There's two Dio's on this roster, I just noticed. That's funny as fuck. Okay. We're well, playing fucking two... Heritage for the future now. Let's go. Hold well, on, there's two Dio's in it? Is it like mm -hmm. part one, part three Dio? They're both part three Dio. It's <laughs> it's part three Dio with the stupid jacket on, then it's part three Dio without the jacket on, and his tits are just out a little bit. Honestly? We're all here for tits out, Dio. A little bit, yeah. I'm saying it's not even his tits, it's, it's, it's his brother's, but that's beside the point. Oh yeah, I forgot that he just stole tits. <laughs> <laughs> New form of top surgery. <laughs> God, all caps Dio is so stupid. I know that's how they differentiate it, but like, it's it's dumb. But it's good, but it's also dumb. It may be stupid, but it's also dumb. I want to play as Cars. Yeah, I'm surprised they haven't done a lot with Cars. I know Cars is in um, All-Star Battle. Did they add for R again? For All-Star Battle R? Forget. You have, to, you have to just shout his name, Dio. It's like that. Oh. Oh, that's right. They added in a bunch of losers. At least they added in Speedwagon. So. They added the most important man. Mm-hmm. 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 <laughs> the gayest man of all time. I can't believe we put like 36 cars on the moon in one of those uh, like spin-off JoJo things. The George Joestar novels, that shit is hilarious. I don't even know even, what's even up with those games. Well, not the game, the book specifically. It's like Diablo and Giorno are the same person. Um, fucking, there's Funny Valentine, Funnier Valentine, and The Funniest Valentine. What other shit is in this fucking book? All the DLCs from ASB. Weather Report. Uh, freaking Yakio. Yakio. Diego. Yeah. Cool. I'm glad someone knew how to uh, pronounce that because I was about to struggle in that for a while. <laughs> uh, you forgot about uh, Speedwagon who got in the uh, who got in the re-release too. Wait, were they just DLC DLC? Okay. Okay. Yeah, Foo Fighters also got added to um to the re-release. 
Oh, and Prosciutto and Pesci got added. Yuyako, Mariah, Pet Shop. That's because you never played Speedweed? Damn. I remember, love Speedweed. Remember when, mm -hmm. uh... There's, like, the fucking... They made Von Stroheim a DLC character. Sure did, sure did, sure <laughs> did. Everybody, everybody loves Guile's original form. Like I'm all here for like a lot of those. Von Stroheim is one hell of a pick. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Probably people complain. I don't know why. <laughs> like if he was part of the base roster, I probably wouldn't pay it that much mind. The fact that he's a DLC character is like. Yeah, like like. But it is very funny, because people have to just pay money for this. If you see somebody online out there, like, hmm, I see. No <laughs> yeah, you have to raise an eyebrow at anyone who plays Monstroheim, because, like, they paid extra to play as the, mm -hmm, the freaking mm -hmm. Nazi character. Yeah. People well, definitely like, do that. Weather Report, and, uh... Who else? It was, like, Metallica was one of them. Oh uh, yeah, uh, uh, what's his name? Risotto, yeah. They have a part four deal in the release too. But who was just straight up DLC? Oh, Kira was? That's funny. Vanilla Ice. Imagine Pink. Well, you know, people people are like that sometimes, you know? It's 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 cringe. Um Imagine so being the kid yeah. who just goes like, Alright, I got my allowance, I'm gonna spend it buying Von Stroheim in my favorite fighting game. <laughs> Someone would definitely do that is the thing. I still love how, like, the only quote-unquote positive thing that come out of Stroheim is the, the silliness with, uh, fighting games, specifically. Because it's like... How did it go again? It's someone... So, Araki makes part two. Uh, someone at Street... Someone at Capcom looks at, at Stroheim's design and goes like, Hmm, hmm, I like the haircut, and makes Guile. Then... Araki sees Guile, goes, hmm, like that haircut, makes Polnareff, and then someone sees Polnareff, goes, hmm, like the haircut, and makes uh, Benny Morrow from KOF. Which is a very funny way for that to kind of work. And that's how the uh, order of events goes. It's very nondescript to me sometimes, but it's, it's very, very fucking funny how that happened. And now I have funny Sonic Boom Man in the streets. All from oh, I forgot Stroheim. New Moon Poochie was a DLC character. <laughs> Gotta say, I think it's mad, mad funny that, like, they decided to make, uh, they decided to make their knockoff Stroheim an American. Like, they just, there's a lot in that. There's a lot in that, <laughs> if you think about it for a second. You know what I mean? <laughs> like... Oh, Shigechi was also DLC. I'm not sure this is like DLC for like the base space game or for like the actual like All Star Battle R. This is very non Let me see what they added. DLC for all ASB? You got it, Captain. Alright, thank you. Stairs is done. Ooh, Ray. And then you have everybody's favorite character, Bao. Yeah, I remember... I should, I should finish that OVA at some point. <laughs> I remember seeing Bao in it. I was just like, who is this? And then my roommate, who knows everything about Araki, was just like, holy shit! <laughs> yeah, like, I, I imagine you would be like, holy shit, because, like, that's a deep cut reference to something that, like, probably no one fucking knows about. People just care more about uh, JoJo's than they do about a lot of Rocky's other work. But uh, 
Bow is actually kind of cool. I saw a little bit of the uh, OVA. It actually looks really cool. I see a little bit of Common Rider, and I'm glad that like um they've taken taken a lot of those designs too for uh, SNK characters because a character named Neo Dio looks exactly like him. I think in like Adult Coliseum, I think. Yeah. Look at this fucker. Yeah, that's him. Looks like Cars too a little bit. Yeah, I remember hearing that Negative Cars. Negative the world's population is even aware of Bow. Yeah. I remember hearing that like. A lot of Bow's designs were uh, recycled for uh, friggin' cars. The whole yeah, like arm can, blade can, things and like yeah. the hair and then the fucking uh, the gem going on his forehead thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Looks a lot like that. I like that all of his attacks are just called phenomenon. That's kind of hype. Bow Dark Thunder Phenomenon. Wait, they changed how this works. That is so much better, actually. But the real question is, how many of us are aware of hit uh, media, hit iconic media, um, Diesel? Diesel? I know Diesel. <laughs> Diesel's the real oh, JoJo. John Diesel, can you fuck? I, I, mm, I feel like I'm making that up. But that's his name. It's John Diesel. Oh man, I, I hope we get like JoJo localized as like a Netflix show, and he just gets called Diesel instead. That'd be funny as fuck. I forgot how shit the stand designs look in this. I forgot. <laughs> I feel like if if like four kids handled a JoJo's Bizarre Adventure thing, Jotaro's like Western name might have been fucking <laughs> Diesel. <laughs> probably. <laughs> it would probably just end up being like John Jonathan or some shit. Like John Johansson. Whatever the fuck. Shit. I don't know if they even managed to keep the whole JoJo naming thing consistent. I think they wouldn't be a, like, what's it called? Original enough? Yeah. Jonathan Joestar again somehow? Yeah, I think I think people would just call him Jonathan Joestar. That kind of makes a lot more sense, too. Yeah. Cool. The walls of this place look absolutely like out of sync, but fine. That's how it wants it. That's how it wants it. Hell yeah. Out of sync and out of time. That's how Ebenezer Scrooge likes his room, I guess. It's true. Wants to be the most pristine. She put a fucking <laughs> gramophone in there. I think he'd like that. Oh my god, there's so much things to fucking buy. I have to set this up at a kitchen. That explains why it's kind of set up like this now, actually. Speaking of uh, live-action anime, how do we feel about live-action One Piece? What? <laughs> yeah, it's happening. That is a real thing that is happening. It looks... okay, I think? But it's a Netflix thing, so I'm I'm waiting for the pin to drop. Why does Netflix keep making live action like anime? Hmm. <laughs> people like live action, they like uh, animation now, I guess. Plus, it's easier. You don't have to worry about um, hiring animators. You're just gonna, you know, do shitty live action stuff. Like have Light Turner. You know Light. everyone's favorite guy, Light Turner. Oh, I love Light Turner. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't help but laugh. I'm pretty sure I'm about to perform called? an OSHA violation. Death Note live action. Hell yeah, you know it. That's that's what you play this game for. 
<laughs> this is so bad. <laughs> Hell yeah. I have a feeling I was you supposed to make helmet. this wall freaking uh, fixed up for this, but uh, oops. Mm -hmm. Oh god, how am I supposed to put the tube over it? That's fine, the tube can be over here. The smoke will go that way. Uh, speaking of stupid live action, I, I'm excited for hopefully a new live action Dragon Ball movie to come out. That'd be stupid. I'd love that. It'd be so bad. Oh, we're getting another Dragon Ball Evolution? I would love that, genuinely. That'd be hype. It'd be the worst. <laughs> just think of the edit where he's just sliding his head everywhere. Oh, man. I'm looking at the... Uh... Watch, they try localizing Jotaro live action. You get Tom Hardy as Jotaro, Ryan Reynolds as Polnareff, and Jason Momoa as Tio. You! Like, honestly, you you wish, Jolene. You're getting it fucking Tom Holland as as uh, Jotaro. You fucking wish. Cryptid Code, thank you for the follow. Hey, what's up? Hi, Indrid. What's going on? Saying. One thing I will say about the live action One Piece is that, like, they. they they did cast, um... <laughs> That's where the saint is! <laughs> they, they casted Usopp pretty well. I will say that. He looks good. I love how wrong this kitchen is! <laughs> You're in ad hell, but you can't... You can't believe you missed an hour of had hustle bar. I wish I could just make Twitch never play an ad. I, I do too. I Shimmy, do. thanks for gifting a sub to Cryptid Code. Let's go. Throwing these, throwing these, uh, fucking, <laughs> these subs like it ain't no thing. Let's go. Hell yeah. I also believe yeah, that is man. a new notification for, uh, gifted subs that I put up. That's just Miku oh, dancing. Man. Hell yeah. Look at her go. Hold on, I need, I need this to go fucking somewhere else. Go, can I put it on the roof? I can't put it on the roof. Go into the corner. We don't need fucking... Uh, fucking... I'm not gonna call them cherubs, that's not what they are, those are pontus. Yeah, there was a live-action Jojo movie, but it was made in Japan. Right? It's the only Jojo I've watched. You know what? You're probably better for it. I know right now, that... Just... I am knowledgeable enough to know that cherubs are not little baby angels. I'm 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 chuckling a little bit at fucking um at one of the One Piece games that came out semi recently where um so the swordsman character uh from from One Piece has a really shit that's in the direction and I think if you get like 999 skill points you can make his sense of direction not garbage and it's funny as fuck it's so funny because as your sense of direction is me is messed up on that character your mini map is just all fucked up. But if you get all the skill points you need, you can actually get a functioning minimap on that character. I th mm. Also about the uh, the part four live action movie, I think the funniest thing about it is that that poor guy having to give himself a reverse mohawk. That poor, poor bastard. Fucking <laughs> got the Thomas Jefferson. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's so funny on Zoro. Yes, yes, yes. It's funny as fuck. I love it. I love it so much. It's so good. <laughs> I'm gonna have Osha at fucking Ebenezer Scrooge's house. Honestly, I, I'd play a decent One Piece fighting game. Uh, I think? I don't know. I'm not sure. Um, some adaptations I feel like should be, like, have some connecting threads, but, um, I'm gonna be real, uh, I just saw Shin Kamen Rider today, and I have to say, Bobu, you're so fucking right. You were, you were generally so fucking right. Sometimes you can have your adaptation not be 100% accurate, and it'll still fuck severely. Cause, God, that was a good-ass movie. I'm not gonna talk about it too much, but what a good... Fucking movie. Yeah, I've definitely like experienced some things of just like you breaking away from source material can make something a lot more interesting. Mm-hmm. Like, 
There's a movie that's just like the tale of Noah's Ark, just called Noah. I don't think it's a particularly great movie, but I like the depiction of angels in it. <laughs> that's fair. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm laughing because like bringing up any kind of biblical movie makes you think about fucking Exodus. And remember the whitewashed uh, Sphinx and I just start to lose it a little bit. I can't, I can't help it. It's, it's so fucking funny to me. Have you ever seen that? I don't think I have. Let me show you this picture. I'll put it in the uh, in the actual streamer voice call voice chat. The one of Russell uh, Crowe? I believe Russell Crowe was in that movie, yeah. It's been like so long since I saw it. I remember like when I watched it, it was like when I was really like getting into like freaking uh, angel myth and whatnot. Mm -hmm. And I'm still like super into it for like fucking <laughs> the cool reasons. And it's just like... I knew what angels those were. <laughs> the freaking also the picture of fallen angels like unable to fly because um, their bodies were turned to stone is kind of neat. That, that's that's kind of cool. I like that. But uh, they never say the angel's name once in the movie, but it's Samyaza, and then the credits they're credited as Samyaza. I was like, I freaking patted myself on the back so much when I saw that. I was just like, I knew. I'm a knower. <laughs> The White Watch Sphinx! It's so bad, it's so fucking funny. Oh god, it's terrible. <laughs> I don't know how they managed to do this and not just recoil in like abject, like self directed cringe. Because I would explode Hold if I had to look at that shit and work Open on it. image. I'm going. Uh, Exodus, gods, and what was it called? Exodus, gods, and kings. And it's like, who even the fuck? Oh no, it's not displaying the message. I can't put it on stream. That sucks. I wanted to just have that in the corner of the stream from this point on. Oh man, I don't think we, I don't need, I don't think we need to curse the chat with this. Enter code? What? Um. Among Us. What oh, Among Us, you say? What the fuck did I. Among Us. Among Us. I'm sorry, I legit cannot help myself. Anyway, here's a... A approximation of a kitchen. You know... This Hell is, yeah. This here is like if you told a fucking AI program to make a kitchen, it would make something like this. The idea of a chicken, the the impression of a chicken, like, the lacroix of the, a kitchen. The vague idea of everything a kitchen needs is here, but... Stove's there. You know what this is? This is, this is a sitcom-ass kitchen. <laughs> All right. This is the Breaking Bad kitchen. Exodus, Gods of Kings, so it's like an old strategy game. You're right, yeah. I need to drink water. Take a big swig. I need water more than I realized I drank the whole thing. <laughs> Hell yeah. Just take a big swig. Chug a lug a lug. Actually, molding over the cabinet gap. <laughs> what do you mean? Hey, what's up? What, what are you talking about? <laughs> I, I think you might be uh, making things up. <laughs> I'm just glad oh, they made trolled the movie. <laughs> You're gonna lose points over that. <laughs> oh <Hell> no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You didn't align it properly. You're gonna, you're gonna lose subscriber. No, I can't believe we're painting over this tiled wall. Who, who the fuck would ever? That's Grody. Ew. Ugh. I'll get the worst ending score. Yeah, I, I think Ebenezer Scrooge gave me a ten out of ten. Yeah, you listen. You're gonna get the the house of her bad end where your house gets turned upside down. Here's the thing about the Scrooge, he invests in crypto, he's gonna see that, he's like, it looks just like the thing freaking uh, AI generated, it, it's so good. Don't, please, <laughs> please, uh, please promote uh, Ebenezer coin. <laughs> Scrooge bucks, let's go. Scrooge bucks, Scrooge bucks. <laughs> it's fucking sick, let's go. Hell yeah, back tub. Do I have Time cheats on? Mess. I do not. Uh, 
bath tub. Twitter is really a, a lawless country and not for the reasons that you might think. It's because I just opened up Twitter and one of the first things I see is someone drawing fucking Jerma as a vampire. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, I, 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 I guess that's what it is. Alright, we put the toilet in the middle room, we don't do that. I am tempted just to put the toilet. Like, by the bathtub. Transform bunny? Oh, you say no oh, more. Oh, metamorphosis? Dark go. metamorphosis! Really should add the fucking... What's it called sound effect? The fucking uh, Yoshi's Island transformation sound effect to that every time someone does oh, it. Oh, I would love to be set that up, I just don't know how. Don't worry, I will help. <laughs> if I need help, because I can, I can do that shit. I know how to do that shit. I don't know how to, like, put custom coding into fucking the PG Tuber thing I'm in. You can just uh, have the sound effect play, and then you can just transform it afterwards. Uh, I can, I can yeah. set that up so it's just tied to channel points. Which is just, I do it through my butt. So shout outs to fucking voice mod for fucking breaking? <laughs> yeah, that happens to me, like, almost all the time. It's just like, hey, can you can you function, please? And I'm just like, mm, what if you wanted to play a sound effect and I just didn't? What are you gonna do then? Tell me. Probably it, it, yeah. Toilets on wheels like an office chair. Hell yeah. For shitting on the go. That's a million dollar idea. <laughs> Introducing new tornado shitting. Alright, who else here when they were kids just like saw office chairs and just like fucking put their head on the back of it and start running forward like they were goddamn like triceratops or some shit? Running through the oh, house yeah, making was, mayhem? That was, that was fun, yeah. That was sick. We should start doing that again. Let's normalize that. Hell yeah. Let's renormalize uh fucking office chair jousting. Yeah. Playtime should exist for adults. Thanks, if I was choked on my cereal. I'm sorry, I can't help it. Sometimes I say things that are kind of funny. <laughs> I like saw a video that was like a place where it's just like a bunch of fucking play like things for exercise. And it's just like mm -hmm. Man, how come this isn't normalized if I'm tired of gym exercise equipment? If it was just all like playground shit, I would be fucking. Oh, yeah, like, the, like that adult like play place, like a fucking Chuck E. Cheese. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that place looks kind of cool. I, it, it's definitely. It has to be less gross than the actual ones for kids, because, dear lord. Yeah, adults tend to be at least cleaner than kids. Vaguely. Well, is one of these going to be red? No, none of these are going to be red, so we get the blue carpet uh, leading to the toilet. Damn. Can't get the red carpet to there. How are we going to- How are we going to bring Mario in here without red everywhere? This is so sad. Oh, uh, don't worry, we have adults. pictures of squares, yeah. though. If you think about it, everything and anything can be a challenge. You just have to see if you can step up or just leave. Just walk out. You can leave. Challenges. Adversity. Cops if you're quick. If it sucks, hit the bricks. Can you spend the rest of the stream building a catacombs network underneath the house, please? I don't think I can, like, do, like, change the actual layouts like that, but I would love to. <laughs> Bungalins Labyrinth. That's kind of what I have under, like, the house. It, it, it's it's the same as, like, a regular Labyrinth, except it's just Bungalin instead of a Minotaur. Infinitely more dangerous. Mm-hmm. Well, of course, who needs a shower? Just take a bath. Just get in there, like... <laughs> 
Just stand underneath the faucet for the uh, bathtub, and you'll just be fine. That's taking a shower. Just, just slump down. You'll be all right. Just sloop. Yep. I'm just thinking you know of that it. fucking thing of like Mario musical sloop down another pipe. But if you ask me, more pipes mean a more problems. <laughs> what the fuck? It's true. More pipes mean more problems. Damn. Mario oh. afraid to hit the hit the hit the blunt pipe. So sad. Hold on, I'm I'm actually gonna find the fucking TikTok. Let's go. Sloop down another pipe. Please tell me this alone will get me it. No, it's not. Hold on. So sad. If Mario was a musical, I think is what it's called. No, none of these are right. <laughs> I hate how the first one is by the dude who made Story of Undertale. Yeah, that's about right. That's about what I expected. I was going to make a joke about that. Like, is the guy who made that going to be there? Uh, uh, racist Mario, let's go! <laughs> Oh, let's let's know instead. <laughs> Let us not say we didn't. <laughs> let's look at that, realize this isn't worth it, and then turn around and leave. Listen, you're not that short. I, I don't. I wouldn't know. <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, Bobo, you get shorter every time we have a discussion. <laughs> you are shrinking as we speak. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I can. What if I put it? Come on, I just want a spot that like perfectly fits it, which was right here. But I'm keeping it there. I'll figure out somewhere else Hell for this. Yeah. <laughs> Mini mushroom SFX. Yeah, you get it. You understand. <laughs> All right, sofa. What color? Sofa. That's sofa so be? fucking cool. But um, um. <laughs> Well, I can make it look more fitting with the rest of the room. Got a very coffee cream look to it. Hell yeah. Oh shit, I need another one. The Traverse Town theme? I didn't catch that instantly. Wait, what? Hell yeah. <laughs> hey, I'm just looking this up. What the fuck is the story of Undertale thing? Looks like Family Guy. Yeah. <laughs> listen. Listen, you've got the basic gist. If that if it already if it if it brings that energy to you, you can probably guess where it's going. It's nowhere good. Right. Uh, story of Undertale. So glad I never like saw that video. I love of, cursing like, people with that video. Ugh. I like cursing people with other videos or other bits of knowledge, but like sometimes you just look at something and just like, mm, nah, and you just walk away. <laughs> you know, I'm done. <laughs> yeah, like, this is this is this is too much. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go home. Goodbye. So I'm, like, listen, I've been taking the if it sucks, hit the bricks to heart, and I'm gonna keep doing it. I see shit that sucks, I leave. I floor it. Piano under the stairs. Things I want to actually be cursed with is heavy chaos and crocs because that's what's actually funny to me. Listen, you need to put some shoes on that beast, like, inst like immediately. <laughs> like, put some shoes on happy chaos and Luke now. Like, I know Luke has shoes on one of his other, like, costumes. That's not the point. He should have shoes on all the time. I'm, I'm sick of hearing those wet beasts slap against the floor when I'm doing anything. It's awful. Well, that's not the correct kind of wood either. What the fuck kind of wood are these made out of? Not that. Not that. Not that. Um... Do I not have access to the wood that everything else in here is? I just have to go with closest approximation. People won't notice. 
I don't know what to say to your to say to your cat, uh, Indrid, but um, oh yeah, that that I hate it. I hate it so much. I hate it so much. I hate it so much. You guys fucking sick at, at animating and shit. But God, I hate that so much. Ugh. Oh, okay. Wait. Wait. Like no table oh, here. Okay. Where yeah. does it want me to put these chairs around? You know what? I'll just. Well, I'm gonna need to match everything you, else. You look huge. <laughs> okay, look Puritan huge. afraid of human skin. That is not what I'm saying, but sure, we can we can play this road. Um, but yeah, I, I listen. Here's the thing: you see enough, like I, I get white people jump scared now. You see enough of them, you just get like it's like oh. <laughs> That's how I feel looking at Luke at any moment, at any given time. It's like oh. <laughs> it's scary. White man jump scare. What the fuck am I putting this globe? It's going here for now. <laughs> Electric fireplace. Yes, say no oh. feed it pride. Listen. Yeah, of course. You, I'm using the metric system, idiot. Um, it cooked. You fucking dunked on gamer. Ugh. <laughs> 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 uh. I love that stupid sound effect so much. It's so fun. Uh, I forgot about somebody's Tinkaton May mod. Oh, it's pretty good. It's Waylord. Who's the, is that many chairs? Listen, we have a lot of people over. This is where the TV is. People have to watch it from all the way over here. <laughs> Plus two. Thank you. Who are you getting plus two to? I, I actually don't know. Wait, who's I've getting this plus two? Please. Who's getting it? I've been such a good girl. <laughs> <laughs> who's getting the who's getting the gamer points? Redeemable and you're participating uh Pizza Hut, Dunkin' Donuts, and for some reason, Bed Bath and Beyond. For some reason. <laughs> Put it right there. <laughs> the goddess has inscribed this plus two to the funniest. That's good as fuck. Okay. You know what? You know what? That's good. That's pretty good. All right. Then, <laughs> then here, I I, I I bequeath it to Bun. There you go. <gasps> yeah. Hooray. the bungo server right now <laughs> that's sick that's actually hype check the hold on what's going on in my server that's actually sick let's go <gasps> You're going to need more than that to impress me. Oh shit! God. <laughs> it's good as fuck. Let's go. I need to play TF2 now that the update's here. I might play a little bit. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm busy deciding. I have like six hours in that game. I'm begging for humans to consolidate the discords. So I can't be in a server for every person I know. Well, that, that, that means you just don't love us enough, Bobu. Why don't you love us enough? This is so you were yeah. so mean to us. Come on, join the bungalow. Yeah, why don't you? Why don't you love us enough? This is so sad. Come on. Come on. Oh, wait, I know where I'm putting these rugs. These are going. Come on. Here. What? Okay. Wait. What? Christmas. Those <laughs> balls. I gotta, I gotta do some investigative research. Learning that that's the 
freaking grandma is the same VA as Shelda and from uh, Bug Snacks and Sabathun from Destiny 2 was great. Mm. <laughs> grandma, you always know what you always know what to say. <laughs> Christmas. Yes, I agree. Oh fuck, she's in a lot of stuff. She's Amanda Waller. She's Kit and Ratchet and Clank. She was on the boondocks. She was Storm? Bro, let's go. Manju. Koye. Another piece of meat you forgot about the rest of the kids save Christmas. <laughs> Grandma, you always know exactly what to say. <laughs> Let me see. I gotta find like exactly. I gotta find the whole roster. Another roster is just fucking ridiculous. Anyone who goes to the kitchen must suffer the mistletoe. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> Hold on, horse not, Christmas tree. Not Deborah Wilson voicing Kamala Harris and Beyonce. Oh my god. What? Oh my god. I forgot some of the people inside of the Rap City Kids uh uh characters. I I, I forgot that fucking Mark Hamill was in Rap City Kids. Fucking Nancy Cartwright? Incredible. You know who voices the um the main kid in Rap City Kids? Ricky Rogers? Would you like to know? That is one uh Walter Emmanuel Jones, probably best known for his role as Zack Taylor in Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. It's all connected. We've gone right back. <laughs> We've gone full back circle. In, baby. We're back in, baby. I, I, I know I want him to rest. I still want like Mark Hamill to voice Starscream at least once. I need to see it. I need to see it. I need to hear it. He'd be so good at it. That Jody Benson? What the fuck don't they have in this movie? Woo! I have completed oh. the house, but it's never complete without the finishing touch that all houses need. And it goes in the bedroom. Yeah, I generated books, yeah. Vlad the Impaler. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I mentioned that, I mentioned that, I mentioned that. It's still sending me for a, a loop. Fucking wild. The Uncanny Kitchen? Six thousand, that's a lot of money. Yeah. I wouldn't mind, I wouldn't mind flipping houses for that kind of scratch that'd be hype. Yo, Jeff Bezos, you there? <laughs> you can yeah, make send it. us send us their seed money, you fucker. <laughs> Yo, here's the thing, Jeff Bezos, I know you love my streams. <laughs> yeah, listen. <laughs> Got the analog yeah, horror kitchen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Got the fucking uh, tattletale so, kitchen, let's go. So, in all fairness, I was asked specifically mm -hmm. to make a lot of floor space in the living room because it was going to be like a dancing room. That's the only reason I did it. <laughs> we should have, like, actually tried to recreate the Rhapsody Kids, like, house. That would have been fucking hysterical, I think. Like, the whole thing was Ebenezer Scrooge was setting up a large Christmas party and a lot of people were going to be around. Where's my bunny wabbit? Bunny wabbit. A, a large dance room to make them all forget that he bust. He tried to union bust. Oh, 
one. Pick up Wabbit. Pick up the bunny. Yes! Perfect video game. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I'm why did you scoop that beast? <laughs> I love the fucking... You're a robot? <laughs> yeah. I don't know why that's so entertaining to me. <laughs> no, it's a cyborg. It's a little different, you know? Doggy in a hat. A dog I don't even remember adopting. I think they just sort of live here. This is their house. Mega Rabbit cheat code. I love Mega Rabbit cheat code. That sounds hype. What's the Mega Rabbit cheat code? Hold on. We play outside. Okay, first things first, you need a different name. Uh... They're a Dalmatian? Oh, I guess they're just too young to have spots. Okay. That Star Wars. <laughs> yeah, sure. Why not? Star Wars is a beautiful name for a baby girl. I was going to name them Star Wars Episode 4 A New Hope, but... <laughs> this is wonderful music for what that, I'm looking at. I'm, I'm still laughing at that fucking one AI-generated fucking Barbie Batman picture that just forgot the Twin Towers are gone. <laughs> so fucking funny. Oh shit, more mail? Ebenezer Scrooge? What a waste of money! I hired you before, so I expect a discount for a return client. My ex fiance introduced me to costly changes that left me to deal with them. Uh, there's a lot of useless junk laying around, such as extra tableware. Make sure to sell lamps and there's no need to pay for electricity. Candle will do. The same goes for heating. The radiators cost extra. Oh no, what's actually Scrooge that told me to buy all that stuff? Lamau. <laughs> and now the actual Scrooge is fucking contacting me like, I want you to get rid of it. Get rid of all that shit. <laughs> awesome reveal. Hell yeah, incredible. Let's see what we got going on in here. <laughs> Keep all lights, sell all furniture. <laughs> Hell yeah, that, that's how we that's how we do it. That's how we do it. He didn't say anything about the Vlad the Impaler. Th that one came out of my paycheck. What? And this is all wrong. Why is it white? <laughs> Why is there things I didn't even purchase in here? Damn. We just bought a bunch of shit and blamed you. <laughs> Turn this house to the set of a Saw film. Oh my god, he really do be asking me to sell everything. He wants a table, though, in the fireplace. <laughs> He's, like, making me get rid of central heating. I think I'm, I, I don't think I'm really allowed to do this anymore, actually. You can't have- I think it's bad to have centrist heating. Like, there's no heating in this house. It's the middle of winter. <laughs> they say it's centrist heating, but it's actually- it seems to only be, uh, right-leaning, uh, heating for some reason. Weird how that happens, you know? Weird how that keeps happening. <laughs> Very strange. Selling all of their knives and kitchenware. What else you want me to sell? Wooden cabinet, which there's a lot of wooden cabinets. Which one do you Okay, that one in particular. Chandelier, gone. Oven, gone. This is so fucking great. That was, this is the work of Copy Scrooge, yeah. So, um, Tiny Tim had to make an entirely uh, new Scrooge out of scratch because the old Scrooge uh, had to disappear for a little bit. Dude wants a tiny gamer fridge. 
Let's go! I want a tiny gamer fridge. I would love a tiny gamer fridge, actually. Glenn has a tiny gamer fridge and, and gloats about it to me sometimes, and it's like, oh, come on. I, I can't know the fact that I have poor bitch disease. The fridge takes electricity, though? Maybe not that gamer fridge. Mmm. Yeah, sometimes, some, listen. Everything takes electricity. I take electricity. I run a lithium ion battery, so if I get in the, if I stay in the sun too long, I explode. It's happened once, but uh, thankfully it hasn't happened again. Get in a room full of five hour energy bottles. <laughs> ah, Scrooge has been drinking the, <laughs> the fucking G fuel again. <laughs> Scrooge hitting the gamer juice for an hour long gamer session with all of the uh with all the ghosts of Christmas. I don't need direct wiring. Why Wi Fi is fast enough. <laughs> if Wi Fi is okay if I'm close to the router. <laughs> I'm right next to the router. It's not even <laughs> the router's in a different house. I ain't paying for internet. <laughs> and who who needs a wired connection? Wi-Fi is good enough. <laughs> Gamer Scrooge is such a funny concept. <laughs> Hold on, I need to know if I can get like Ebenezer Scrooge PNGs right fucking now. <laughs> Let's go. Here we go. We're we're in there already. <laughs> so I have to ask a quick question. How I don't do want think Scrooge, that, uh... Doug. I want Ebenezer Scrooge. How often do you think that Scrooge would post on scrub quotes? <laughs> yes! Oh my god, it's perfect! I need to download this now! Let's go. I love some of the shit you get to see on the... Yeah, basically, he would do that, he would do that. He'd do the fucking uh, Sanford Kelly Freshmaker and just slam his stick into the pavement. Alright, now I just need to make a... You will be dm by the ghosts of three eSport legends! I do I'm wish sorry, that's a good one, that's a good one. That's good. I do wish it was Scrooge in his freaking like... Sleeping gown, but this works. Hell yes. Speaking of gamer Scrooge, I can totally read. I can totally see Scrooge writing something like this. Drive Impact is going to go down in history as one of the system mechanics of all time. It is really bad game design because it discourages players from pressing buttons. <laughs> Maybe you should be pressing buttons less, my guy. All right, hold on, I need to put this on my other larger monitor just so I'm getting precise work with my brush strokes. Oh, let's go. <laughs> gotta, gotta get really precise with those strokes, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's like, I, I, I get it. I, I understand. <laughs> Be careful. Get 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 too precise and. <laughs> Wait. This joke sucks. Hold on, just to keep I everyone entertained. I realized the reason why this didn't show up earlier is because I actually successfully downloaded it. Here's the whitewash sphinx. Oh, here we go. I from It's a Wonderful Life wishing you never installed Fortnite. Oh no! No! I'm so sorry for what I have to do my done chat to you. I get to look at it too. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Scrooge is the type of guy to complain about people block spamming online. Open them up then! Scrooge doesn't know what to open people up. It's so sad. Pray for my grandpa. He sucks at fighting games. Yeah, it's real bad. It's real bad. Like, it's funny as hell to me, but, like, that's only because it's been so long. And, like, the level of audacity is just 
It's it's incredible. It is it's incredible. <laughs> I don't think I've seen anything like this fucking flagrant in a long ass time, and I'm sure there's more coming. I I, I could I would not be surprised if more is on is, is incoming oh, from shit. this kind of bullshit. Well, Maybe I, I don't know. You need Scrooge gaming. Oh, yeah. let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Father Gascoin, is that you? Yeah, hello, it's me, Father Gascoin. Damn, I loved you in, in, in Bloodborne. <laughs> Thank you, I became a beast. Spent too much fucking money. Was it cool becoming a sick beast? A giant furry? It was kinda, as the gamers say, swag. I see. The sofa has to be walled I'm off. Just trying out a variety of German adjacent bits. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Here's the thing. Damn. People like Germa and Rain Radio TV make my job harder because they're actively being funnier than me. <laughs> yeah, I understand that. I understand that. It's true. I feel that 110%. Makes me go over here like a ah, humbug, you understand? Yeah, I understand. Ah, uh, Ancient Civilizations, my favorite book. I love yep. learning about the Sphinx. <laughs> ancient Civilizations, and it's just, you open it up and it's just fucking a book by those two guys with the, uh, from the ancient alien shit, yeah. The it's... market on jokes call that e-comedy. E that's fuck, holy shit, that's good as fuck, let's go. <laughs> that's hype. I'm just. <laughs> I wanted to get the fucking uh, white sphinx again with ancient history, but hold on. I know what I'm doing. Hold on. <laughs> oh, here we go. Gallery. Jimmy Neutron brain blast moments. Add photo. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> no one he would have this in his house. Yeah. I love ancient yeah. history, what can I say? <laughs> yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, you know what? Here is another idea. I have, an, I have an idea for you to put up in the, uh, in, in the, uh, in the house. Hold on. Yeah? Um... I have to just send this picture so I can find just a standalone picture of this really quick. You know what? Mm, this could work, yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll go with this. Here, try try, try putting this up on a fucking... <laughs> somewhere in this house. Alright, hold on. <laughs> here we go. And here we go. Yeah! <laughs> Absolutely. We in there, gamers. Put that, put that shit up somewhere. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Chad, I'm sorry. I, I'm 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 causing violence to happen to your eyeballs. Oh it's actually my kind of sick. God. I promise. <laughs> yeah, I'm turning this, this into sick. a painting instantly. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. <laughs> yeah, this is the best meta, actually. I love it. <laughs> Hell yeah, motherfucker! Inspiration? <laughs> what do y'all know about this? I'm a bit of a gamer, I hope you know. <laughs> Hold on, I realized something I need to put on my stream because Scrooge is a gamer. <laughs> he needs his gamer juice. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I'm so thirsty, thank you. <laughs> Uh, this one put one of those in my enclosure and it sucks. I'm 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 craving enrichment and it's so sad. I'm crying. Yummy delicious. I'm so sad. Is Scrooge's favorite video game any of DuckTales? No, it's Fight of Gods. I've also played a bit of Call of Duty. 
Scourge also kind of strikes me as a League player. <laughs> Actually, hold on. I haven't done all the rooms down here yet. So I've only I've... played one MOBA. It was uh, the Pokemon one, and I had fun with it, but like, I, I, I'm, I'm glad I dropped it. Yeah, I heard that game very, uh, very uh, exploitative. Yep. Also, I just, I, I heard about them just doing, like, homophobic bullshit on social media. Like, you know, what? you know what? I'm good. I'm done. I'm not playing anymore. Bye. See ya. Ah, uh, it's, it's a very, it's a very fine Christmas. Really I love the gaming. Most Christmas of all time. I'm Ebenezer Scrooge, and I love gaming. Dreaming of a gamer Christmas. Just like the ones you used to know. Drinking nothing but Mountain Dew Whiteout and having an epic gamer session. My favorite flavor of Mountain Dew is Code Red. Because it gets my gamer blood flowing. I can believe that. Look at this clean ass bedroom. Cleanest. But I am screwed and I it's hate it. It's December ween. Actually. Sorry. If you're not celebrating whatever that is you're talking about, but we're celebrating December ween only. This is a this is a Homestar household. No decorative plate I don't just need no decorative plate. I am Scrooge. I only need my fight stick, uh, my gamer chair, and at least five years worth of uh, subscription to my Game Informer magazines. Game Informer, we know all the cool tricks. <laughs> uh, yeah, but guess what? Homestar has surprisingly less racism, so. Pick your poison. Uh, Homestar Runner, that's that funny little guy who talks funny. It's true. I remember my grandkids tried telling me about it, <laughs> when I said, uh, I, I don't understand. Why is he white? Sorry, kids. I'm, I am too busy reading my Penny Arcade. Excuse me. <laughs> I'm too busy reading Penny Arcade. Have you seen I this? Am... It's called Loss. Have you seen this? I am going directly to PAX East this Sunday, after Christmas. I don't know when the fuck PAX even takes place. What's, what's my opinion on some millennial writing? Too much gays. <laughs> Not enough Christmas. Not <laughs> Christmas should be a year-long event. Why do they only do it one day out of the year? This is bullshit. <laughs> this is some bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I love asking people why they're white. It's fun. Self care. Always do it. Turn, flip the script on them. Yeah, this is a very beautiful house. I love how out of place this is to everything in yeah, here. It's, it's, it's such a, it's so jarring. It's so jarring. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> ah, but I got it on sale. It was cheap. It was very cheap. I love ancient history. It was very inexpensive, Douglas. <laughs> I love how this is my voice for him, even though, like, I've never heard an interpretation that sounds like this. Scrooge McDuck. I'm <laughs> Scrooge McDuck. Fucking Ebenezer Scrooge. I know Mercedes Benz. <laughs> What's my opinion of putting Christ back in Christmas? You see, I have a. Yeah, okay, here's the thing. I'm still a very Christian man. I'm tired of them putting capitalism on Christianity. It's true. It's true. It's true. Instead, they should put the real uh, savior, uh, Chris Redfield, back in Christmas. <laughs> they should put Chris Redfield back in Christmas. That's what the Christmas has been for this whole time. It's true. I you wish. see him punch that boulder? It was some wild shit. It is a long-standing tradition for me to punch a boulder every Christmas. It is something I am really wanting to do every day of my life.
damn it. <laughs> Jesus T posed for our sins, yeah, it's true. Uh, Jesus, then Gabumon, then Kamen Rider. Who else got uh, <laughs> hit by that? Gabumon. I think Shadow the Hedgehog, yeah. Remember Shadow got crucified that one time. <laughs> it's me again. I know it's Christmas, but you have a moment to spare. I'll pay any price. <laughs> This is the closer Ebenezer Scrooge to what I've been doing. <laughs> you know who else wants to save Christmas? Ebenezer Scrooge! You see, I left my house in Cobra the Bear, but my miserable attitude is now over. I invited all the people who want to the over. I tried to decorate and renovate some of my own, but time is short and I want everyone to feel the Christmas spirit. After the work is done, please stay for dinner. I will dust this old piano. I hope I remember how to play. I oh. realize why I'm able to, like, do this voice. Finally, some gratitude for a change. This voice is a less screamy and raspy version of the voice I have for a character named Mice. Interesting. It might sound like this. Yeah, Hello, it sounds chat. Like... <laughs> yeah, I, I love your Goldar. Goldar? Yeah, from fucking Power Rangers. The lion guy. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> oh no, bro! Yeah. Goldar sounds like that, and also like Muscle Man. And also like Kuwabar from the Yu Crocker? You're not the first person to say that sounds Crocker. like Crocker! <laughs> That's his name! Nope, Mr. Cracker. That's his name. <laughs> That's his name. That name again. Baby, I did it! <laughs> They're, oh, Jesus. <laughs> that was like one step removed from fucking Joel, it sounded like for a minute. <laughs> I would remember Joel. For my trips across the sea over to Sweden. Getting me to laugh is incredibly easy. Just to say something in like <laughs> the right timing and you get me every time. I'm giving you the F for fairies! <laughs> Damn, Mr. Crocker, you can't say shit like that anymore. It's, it's a different era. He's going around calling people fairies. I can call whoever I want a fairy! Have you seen how the- <laughs> Have you seen how Timmy Turner walks? He's a little, you know! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm big on this. Let's go. <laughs> uh, this is the best stream. Giving me an F for oh, free. No. Oh no! I'm, I'm in Mr. Crocker's whack up cross up. Oh no! What do you think Crocker's like finding game character archetype would be? Um, probably a zoner. I believe it. True, he can throw out slurs really well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know what? Yeah, yeah, that's... Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, what happened? Scrooge, is there a fire? Oh no. His, <laughs> he, he, he got so mad at fighting games that he just exploded his whole bedroom. Why can't I say it? I invented the word! <laughs> He plays grapplers exclusively? Hmm? Maybe? I don't know. Oh, so the music ended. Hold on. Let's get more music in here. All the candles he lit at the same time, everything got on fire? You're so right. Oh, damn. Uh... Fairly odd parents breaking the rules, OST. Hell yeah. I sure hope that the opening of Fairly Odd Parents isn't copyrighted. This first song is just the opening of Fairly Odd Parents. It probably is Nickelodeon and Viacom, and Viacom has been, well, Viacom on YouTube forever, so. I would play it uh, safe. Let's skip a couple songs. I've heard the song before. This is up on one too many Honda players and said his 
Fire to a setup out of sheer rage? Maybe you should <laughs> parry then, idiot. Just parry. No, no, you don't understand. His head bunch is bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Him and and uh, Blanca. How am I supposed to deal with this shit? What do you mean parry? What do you mean drive rush? I'm I, that shit's not real. <laughs> I'm just meant to block and hold it, and I want to fight. I don't understand. I, I can't drive impact this by eights in the hole. How do they keep going around it? I don't understand. Why do why do they keep grabbing me? Why does it keep working? <laughs> How, the grab spamming is bullshit. This game sucks. <laughs> can't believe this game has grab loops. <laughs> <laughs> And don't get me started on Ken players. Ken players are also bullshit. <laughs> How come Ken is able to wake up so you can? <laughs> it's not uh, humbug. Fair. They're lag switching. Ah, <laughs> uh, humbug. They're lag switching. Ah, <laughs> uh, you to tell that story, or <laughs> that Dalton was lag switching. I swear. <laughs> See now you have to tell the story. Yeah, I was Run playing. I was playing freaking ranked, and every time, like, I was like going in to do a combo, the game started lagging, but my opponent didn't stop going in for it, which makes me think that dude was dead ass lag switching me. I'm not even sure if lag switching is even real. Like, I don't know. I've heard like mixed things about it. Like, nah, it's not real. Or, yeah, it's totally real, and I don't know which is which. Genuinely, at the very least, that Dalton had no honor. <laughs> you have no honor. Like, Regan, when I run into someone who's lacking, I will back off and wait for it to chill out. You have no dignity. <laughs> Damn. Damn. I will say, I will call that my... I would say that first round where the dude just kept going on me through the lags and lagging, interrupting my combo. I would say the lag made me lose that one. But every That's other weird. match was on me. Yeah, be like that. I'm fighting, going to fighting admit, lagging players is always so bad. I had to fight like a, a 600 ping chip uh, yesterday. It was it was mental guard crushing. It was it was really bad. Like a super fast character with lag, and it's hard for me to punish him already. But lag, okay. I guess I just die. You're talking like a negotiator right now because no, that's like how I. No, Neto Tiger. Neto Tiger is a uh, a YouTube guy who's known for just saying like the scrubbiest you've ever heard on youtube in mortal kombat that's fair but that is genuinely how i feel about that first round that i had against that guy after the lag cleared up it was fine i'm fine with losing when the, the lag was happening i just like it when people have honor is the thing you mm. have no honor Need plaster. It's hard to dignify honor sometimes in fighting games. Sometimes you just have to be a fucker a little bit. Listen, the Ken who taunted, I stopped attacking for them to taunt. I, I don't know why that dude taunted. He was at a disadvantage too. Okay, Ryu? Yeah, damn. You're getting red for filth by the chat right now. This sucks. I don't even play Ryu, I play Marisa. <laughs> Want me to also just admit I'm bad at the game? I'm not great at the game either. I'm only gold. <laughs> Gold's pretty good. I do want- uh, I, am, I am bronze right now. I'm a bronze Ken. I don't have any, any other characters right now. I do plan on doing a stream of Street Fighter soon when freaking uh, Rashid comes out. Go do like combo trials with him, his arcade, and so on. I need to be playing more. But I was just I wasn't in the mood to stream this week. I guess after uh, some shit happened. Oh fuck. Oop. That is understandable. I have not been streaming much this week either. Ouch. So I've been like trying to like extremely cut down the amount of sugar I've been intaking lately because uh, I've been realizing it's becoming a problem. Mm-hmm. 
And uh, I think it's causing my manic spirals to go off more frequently. Mm hmm. So, uh, that's why I haven't been streaming that much lately. I'm getting super again. Oh, I got grabs. Yeah, I'm dead as fuck. It also may explain why I, I've been getting, like, more mad at fighting games to see. <laughs> yeah. I think my emotions are just. Because, like, sugar's a highly addictive substance. And removing it, uh. <laughs> yeah, withdrawal. Probably. Missing my conversions have, that I know. Have y'all heard the story details about KR Gotchard? Ligma Shield activate! Oh, what is that? Oh, uh, it's a new Kamen Rider. Ah. Oh, I've seen a little bit of it. I'm excited to see where it's gonna go. conversions right now. I haven't played Street Fighter 6 in so fucking long. I've been focusing on Strive exclusively and it's driving me crazy. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm playing Streets in the background. <laughs> Lol. Lol for now, Street Fighter gaming. A little bit. I wonder, hold on, if you, if you start Discord stream, how easy would it be for me to put your little dis or uh, your little gameplay in the corner? I don't know. Fridge. Oh, big fridge, too. Oh, I, can just... I love gaming. Nice. Oh, this is a corner piece. I should probably just move the sink part of it entirely over. Make this corner piece consistent. Yes, gaming is my favorite hobby. Go. Oh, you've been transformed. Again. Oh, oh Ebenezer Scrooge must die now. Oh, that's right. I forgot about my, my most powerful technique. I wish I had him. I, I wish I found images of him in his pajamas to transform him into. <laughs> Straight up. Yo, what up? <laughs> no, we're not going from one old white guy to another. <laughs> I haven't played this game in forever, but I won. I won the set. Let's go. Let's go. I lost the first game, won the last two. I'm, I'm gaming. Let's go. I'm gonna take a break. I need to just remember what I'm doing with my hands. I still have soul. With you and stream long character bits, it's it's good. The bits are funny. I don't <laughs> mind them. You know, sometimes you just have to love a long going bit. Long running bits are great. I just like doing bits. And remember, I trust bits, bits to be funnier than me. You can donate bits too, Chet. With money. It's, uh, God forbid bunnies do anything. For real, yeah. Okay. 
Hopefully this isn't over at my muscle memory when I play Strive tomorrow in bracket. This time my kitchen will not be an OSHA violation. I supposed to fit this in here. Yeah, I'm not gonna play too much. I'm gonna play more next week before uh, tournament, so I can at least get some more shit in my hands before um, uh, next Saturday's tournament. I need another one of these. It does feel good to press buttons in Street 6. It feels really good to press buttons. I need stronger confirms. I need to play more Kimberly. I need to take Kimberly on rank at some point. But I'll worry about that later. <clears throat> Hell yeah, look at this. Six space. Huh. Uh, hmm. yeah, I was going to say Minecraft Villager sound effect, but you already beat me to it. So what else is up, chat? How we doing? What's the what's the vibe for this Friday evening? We be, we be doing when we were doing the long-awaited Street Fighter Six Hulk Hands Challenge stream. Uh, oh, that's a good question. That's a very good question. I guess I'm just making this awkward disconnected spot because what the fuck else am I supposed to do? <laughs> awkward disconnected spot is my uh. <laughs> It's my favorite Adult Swim cartoon. And who doesn't want to kiss when we're real and fictional? Yeah. One second, I have to. I have to just say this really quick. I have to go into uh, my pocket dimension for this. So true, bestie. So tr I, I feel that every day in my life. Never stop doing have bits. You, I will never stop have you doing just bits. You see women, and you're just like, yeah, as as women. Gamers, friends, associates. Is it gay to women? Two women? That's very gay. Uh, maybe even three. Oh, imagine. snap. Could you imagine three women? Could you imagine? I see women, I think I want to protect you to the ends of the earth. You know what? I can respect that. So true. So true, bestie. Sometimes you just see women and they're like, hell yeah. Sometimes you see two women and like, hell yeah. But then sometimes there's three women and it's like, yeah, that's that's even better than that last one. Better than just two by themselves. I hate that this is genuinely making me hungry. <laughs> that might have women? more to do. No, pretty just what I'm doing here. That <laughs> might have more to do with the fact that I haven't really eaten much today. <laughs> Oh no, you should eat something. I should also probably have something to eat, but I also don't feel like cooking and I don't feel like spending money, so I'm, I'm, I am torn. More plates Truly, of yummies? I am most torn. Uh, Juan. More food in my house. I might just end up just making rice again. It's easy. I don't think the knife should be here. I'm gonna put the knife here. I don't think the knife should be here, Undertale. Why can you just buy food from the furniture store? Because that's where they sell it. I'm sure yeah. Ben's when Ikea, Bobu. You're getting Swedish meatballs and hot dogs. Uh, it's been a while since I've been to Ikea. 
Yeah, same here. Oh, why does it say there's a bunch of filthy? <gasps> good God, he's naked! <laughs> oh, good grief, he's naked! He just left all that shit in there. That's grody. I fucking. <laughs> Oh, I've been rewatching SpongeBob. It's been great. Yeah, early SpongeBob was fucking hysterical. How do they do it? Freaking every episode has had at least one iconic scene in it. Hot, high key hot those go extremely fucking hard. You haven't had one in like forever, but yeah, you you are so right. So true, bestie. Get a fucking Ikea hot dog and your Blahaj plush and you're good to fucking go. You don't need to buy any furniture. That's good enough by itself. I'm so glad I got a Blahaj. One day I'll get one, maybe. Brutalist toilet? It's like the Brutalist butt plug. <laughs> Brutalist toilets are just those toilets I have at, like, high schools. What do you mean that there's just nothing around the shower? School toilets are like, I don't know what they do to make them, but they clearly aren't making them good enough. And then, man, the stories that I could, that I could tell you about bad school toilets, oof. I will not though. It's one of them is just really bad. Friendly reminder, um, <laughs> Military school kids are deranged and fucked up. Keep that in mind for the future. If you know one, pray for them and hope they get out. Odd. Yeah, I thought that was I thought that was Bun's donation information too. And I'm like, damn, you a high roller? Let's go. We gaming. But nah, it's just the game. It's so sad. Oh god, I wish that the freaking information of like how much money I have in game was how much money I had real life that'd be swag oh yeah I, I understand it, it, it sucks that like getting money just sucks sometimes you have to just wait for people to just send you shit like this it's it, it is money is money is hard I wish it was easier to get fun is actually an oil baron Damn. yeah I'm secretly an oil baron this whole time I still have to fill everything here. Did I check upstairs yet, even? No, I did. Everything was on fire, that's right. Fucking... I, I don't even know how that even managed to happen in the first place. How do you how do you burn your house down that bad? The candles. I guess so. Scrooge having JoJo Part 4 happen in his house right now as we speak. Well, let's go. An actual, like, fun color. Let's go. We love fun colors. It's red. It's not white. We want the most whimsical fucking Every life. restraining urge to just make a joke. Do it. <laughs> that I can make. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> we make jokes here. I guess we do. I guess we do. I guess we do. But it's one of those jokes for like... It's it's funnier to me to keep it myself because it's like, you, you know what? Fuck it. Fun colors with me, a fun color. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> Hell yeah. I, I, I never get tired of jokes like that. I, <laughs> I don't know if like Dak was actually upset, but like Dak was saying, oh yeah, you can be on color commentary. Like, yeah, color, uh, yeah, it could be a color commentary and colored commentary. Let's go. It's my favorite. Sometimes you just have to make a good joke like that. It, 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 it fills me with joy to just say dumb shit like that. It is very fun. It is very fun. I wouldn't believe it. <laughs> Fucking... Let's go! Big points! Soon I'll be the top of the fucking leaderboard, gamers. Let's go! Thank you for the points, Fucking Jimmy. quick! It was very good! <laughs> I, I, I love how fast it is. It's very fun. It's one of my favorite sound effect buttons to just press. Like at any moment something cool happens, just press it. 
I see Resident Evil shit is just like bad. Like I, I, I fall in a pit and I just have that happen. I play that sound effect. I think it'd be funny. Is the lyric of that just a robot saying Wednesday? Uh, what are you listening to right now? Sorry. Break, uh, break into rules. Maybe I would believe that. Wednesday. New July 18th, my birthday. Can you play a silly sound? Oh, you got it. Uh. Here we go. Questions. There you go. That was a very good sound. <laughs> Happy belated. Uh, I, I should not have done that. I'm so, I'm so glad I was able to find that. The room as intended. The epic gamer room with all kinds of sick Christmas theming. Perfect to play all kinds of Christmas themed fighting games like Clay Fighter. And that's it. Why does the soundtrack kind of like doing some cool shit though? It'd be like that when you're when you have like a game like that. Sometimes you just have games that just kind of are like licensed games that are kind of just banging. It's really inconsistent and weird. It's like it's the thing of like, hey, you, your cousin makes music, right? Can you get them? And then like that cousin makes like some of the coolest shit ever. Yeah. Is this like a giant dog bed? What the hell? Someone get Gwen in here. <laughs> mm, okay, well, I'll see what I can do. I'm, I'm putting psychic waves out into the internet. Maybe soon we can summon Gwen in here. You <laughs> boxed. Wait, that did not say gamer bedside cabinet. Okay, I actually got fucking like, wait, what the fuck? The bit manifested? <laughs> we love to manifest a bit. You know, speaking of gamer beds, I've seen this like stupid ass gamer black and red gamer bed and it does kind of look cool. And I hate that it looks kind of cool. At least I can find a picture and put it in the uh, streamer voice chat. One of my favorite things is just like you can take any mundane anything, just put the word gamer in front of it, and you it's Oh, there's the gamer bed. There's the epic gamer bed. Like a gamer chair? You know what a gamer chair is. A gamer bed? You can imagine a gamer bed. We're getting. Yeah, gamer, gamer bed looks like this. It's kind of a cool setup, but it also looks like a nightmare. This looks like. This looks like fucking Ant City. But I oh, would okay. use it. The most cursed shit, the gamer diaper for those long-term streams. Oh no. <laughs> Remember the gamer dress? Gamer I, dress is still so funny to me. I don't think I can find it. I don't think Where I can is find it. <laughs> Where's that? Uh <laughs> Exclamation point diaper check. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Why is oh that so god. funny? Oh my god. Oh, here it is. Here's the fucking stupid gamer dress here. Look at this stupid shit. What is the gamer dress? Let's find out. Oh yeah, that is a gamer dress. It looks so ass. It looks so doo-doo cheeks. Uh, it's this black and red gamer dress made by a bunch of, like, cis dudes, and it looks so fucking bad. Ugh. Look at this. Oh yeah, we're putting it up on stream. I'm sorry, Chad. You have to look at this with your eyeballs. Looking wacky and wild with it. This, I can I can tell the person the people who made this dress just love fucking Rick and Morty. 
You can just tell. It's like an aura you can sense. Top 10 Rick and Morty bits. Thanks for watching. If you want to look like you were manufactured by Alienware, yeah. <laughs> Little gamer clothes you wear in black See, the funniest thing about, like, that shit is that, like, I, I do wear, like, a fucking video game branded hat, but it's, like, the only hat I wear that isn't, like, utter shit and isn't, like, you know, advertising my cringe military school right now, so... Something I wish I bought when it was, like, around, I don't think it's for sale anymore, which is a shame, is mm -hmm. a thing of just, like, Mickey Mouse and Mario making out with the text, just try and sue us. The Mao. <laughs> I think that might still be around somewhere. Um, I think at one point I need to just, like, buckle down and deal with it and just get a replacement string for my fucking Earthbound yo-yo, because I've had it forever and I don't have a replacement string for it. God. Actually, it's just like a game you're dressing yesterday, you're talking about how cool Shadow the Hedge is, Viv. Listen. Shadow the Hedgehog is cool, designed to be cool, but like the gamer dress is designed by like nerd bros to put on women for just mm, me pingy and it's garbage, it's dog shit. It's two separate, uh, what's it called? Two separate circumstances. There you go. Chat, if I put on the gamer dress, would you get horny? Oh, balls in your chart. Balls in your court, chat. Answer quickly. Answer quickly, or else you may experience an unexpected ex sensation. If I'm the one wearing it, that's the correct answer. <laughs> <laughs> Vampire's clock. Oh my god, he remembers Vlad. Damn. Why is it so large? Oh my god. What kind of Castlevania bullshit? Who needs a clock this big? What in the shit? Alright, I, I, I guess. Oh my god. Vase. Can I make the vase red? Everything else in here is red. Uh, Vlad the Impaler, I barely know her. Impaler, her, I hardly know her. <laughs> ah, ah, a very nearsighted man. You know what? You're right. Sorry for being insensitive and uninclusive. I will think about this in my gamer sensitivity training. <laughs> I'm gonna live with my mother bungling is probably my fault! Oh my god! <laughs> Why did you have head? I am so sorry. But <laughs> if you look at like the chat and like a couple messages up, it does say this stream is intended for a mature audience. Mature. Mature. You know, mature. <laughs> in scare quotes, in massive scare quotes, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> That's so funny. I finally got one of those kind of like messages. So it's like, I was watching this with my parents. <laughs> Fuck yeah. That's hype. That's awesome. Let's go. <laughs> Getting my mother to run into Twitch to complain about the Bulgaria of the stream. Yeah, you might as well just fucking. <laughs> <laughs> you might as well go to a fucking McDonald's and complain that there's food there. You're not gonna get it any any better anywhere else. This is about as good as it gets as far as Twitch content goes. Genuinely, I have peak content, and y'all should uh, be very grateful. And uh... remember to sub, follow, and donate, cowards. Yeah, your next paycheck, all of it. Mm -hmm. Just, just <laughs> throw it in. <laughs> The fucking war horn that played immediately after that. Oh my god. <laughs> We're summoning I, them. That was my fucking villain arc quote. 
<laughs> you fucking said, give me all your paycheck, and the fucking, uh, the fucking playlist said. <laughs> I love how, like, your mic is, or, like, Discord audio compression's eating most of that sound effect. Fuck my whole life. You know what, I think I know why, it's because it's kind of low. Let me turn it up a little bit. Boop. <laughs> This room's kind of ominous with just, like, this one wall here and white everything else. It's sinister room for sinister gaming. Ebenezer Scrooge loves sinister gaming. This, this, this spookiest gaming. What do you think Scrooge's... Gaming with ghosts. What do you think Scrooge's, uh, Twitch channel is called? Um... <laughs> bah Humbug 43, when he was born in 1943. That is a really good answer. That's like the more- The man that's ever lived. Humbug Gaming is also pretty good. I think it should just be Humbug with one G instead of two. Wait. I think it's fine. Humbug Gaming. Works either way. Yeah, it's the emote called Humbugger. <laughs> Humbug champ. Bug <laughs> champ! Bug champ! Oh shit! I'm so smart. I'm, I'm fucking the smartest. Let's go. The fucking gamer ski boots? <laughs> the gamer ski boots for me to play epic connect ski games on. And the epic ski board. Epic ski board from an epic ski ball tournament. Let's go. All right, paint the walls a natural beige. Hell yeah, the, the gay merino board. <laughs> paint my walls a natural beige, like those fucking people painting their entire kids' rooms like some flat nothing color. Oh god, I hate that. It looks like shit. It looks so bad. It's like genuinely it's... bad for kids too. It's true. Gonna do a bason. Make kid rooms like filled with so much stuff. Like, yeah. Let the visual stimuli like appreciate the room for God's sakes. What is a nothing color? A uh, cellophane. Like, a nothing color is like beige or like, it's just one solid singular beige with no other like variety. It's it's so empty. Like, it's, it's horrifying to look at. Nothing colors are like colors that need a accompanying color to complete them. Yeah. So if you're just having like a whole fucking beige ass room. Yeah, landlord beige, there you go. <laughs> landlord beige? <laughs> Yeah, that's the, probably the best way to, to refer to it. Motherfuckers probably got popcorn seedling and shit. Oh, well, I'm turning this all beige now. Hell yeah. <laughs> I'm making the top a bit beige, at least, because that's where I fucked up. Damn, you're making, you're making shit beige, and we're talking about fucking fairly odd parents. This really is a fucking, uh, it's a Pixies bit. Let's go. We in there. It's all connected. Everything loops back around. All right, and introducing special guests, uh, Butch Hartman. Welcome to Stri- Oh, he, he attacked me with a slur and left. <laughs> oh, damn. He just exploded and died. So sad. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> so, so, so tragic. Rip in peace, Mr. Elmer. Anyway. I mean, something I think about when I, like, mention Butch Hartman is the thing of, like, I, again, I think it was, like, uh, Joe Apocalypse mentioned having him as a cameo in one of his things, and he, like, mentioned, like, he was the worst person to work with ever. That sounds about right. I think that was, like, something I saw at one point. What was I gonna say? Oh, yeah, that's right. I was gonna say, imagine fucking 
Having a kid, carrying them in your room for fucking nine months, and naming that kid fucking Elmer. Like, hello? <laughs> like, what kind of name? Tragic. I, I, could, I, I, I could not envision that. That sounds like a fate worse than death. Wait. Scrooge gets its one beige room simply because this room's actually fun. It's the fun room and the beige room. He's allowed one beige room. <laughs> Just one singular one. Put a bow on the door to that room. Uh, Rising social media looking at some stupid, stupid posts that are pretty funny. I'm actually the leader of the Sudanese terrorist group that hacked AO3. We did it because the people didn't like because people didn't like my clan spic and Xi Jinping told me to do told me to. Oh my god! <laughs> For clarity's sake, that's a joke. But you're either a so super fan. Funny. You're either a super fan of Looney Tunes or an absolute psychopath and name your kid Elmer. It's true. It's true. <laughs> that's but why also, Bugs Bunny is. your kid Elmer anyway after the hunter. Like I, that, that character sucks. Like, why would you name- At least name your kid, like, something cool like Yosemite or something. Like, Elmer? Ooh. <laughs> Child built to consume paste. Yo, hello! <gasps> Yo, bun flipper time? It is! True, we're flipping. Dawn, I imagine your stream is over now. I hope it went well. Augers, we love to finish up a stream. Probably just. Have... Oh, I can't have that there. My God, Ebenezer Scrooge, what are you? What is this architecture? Ebenezer, I barely know her. <laughs> All right, that's it. That's the last time I'm saying this bit. It's over. <laughs> At least the decorations here are making is making the base work. Mm hmm Ebon D's nuts? You can't just hit no! that. No! Damn. Well. I'm sorry, chat, but that's my uh that's my kill phrase. Um <laughs> sleeper agent activation phrase. Wait, did Bip actually leave? <laughs> no, I'm still here. I just muted. Okay. <laughs> I, I like, muted after the explosion for for the for the bit. <laughs> I was like, I was genuinely like, hold up, wait, am I actually alone in here now? Nah, nah, nah don't worry. It's 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 a joke. <laughs> it's joke has done irreparable harm to to my vocabulary. I, I legit cannot stop saying it. Anytime there's like a joke happening, it's like, it's a joke! I don't think I've even seen a whole lot of fucking love live where that line comes from. All I know is it's a joke and that's all I need to know. I think. Base. 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 Okay, those two are vases, but that one, that's a vase. True. It's like it's like duck duck goose. Wanna check this shit out? Mm-hmm. Fuck. Wanna check this shit out? Vase and vase to pill. Vase and vase to pill. Okay, okay. That's good. That's good shit. Alright, this sh should be the final room. Oh god, I have to paint all the walls in here? Scrooge, you madman! You absolute madman! I, I I have to I have to be honest right now. I have to be honest. This is might come across as a little bit mean, but it's funny as fuck to me just thinking about it. Congratulations on making a fucking like a quantic dream house. Shut the fuck up, you're right. <laughs> 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 I can already imagine the dude smoking crack on the sofa. Jason! Sean! <laughs> uh, more natural beige. You uh, got it. Beige naturals. 
<laughs> Ebony just screws him <laughs> with his beige naturals. Good for him, good for him. Shout out to the fact that, like, I don't know much about, like, Lord of the Rings shit, but apparently Gandalf can just kill people. Like, that's, yeah. that's his straight up power. It's just, I can burn your soul and permanently delete you. Power of fire, uh, <laughs> power of fire spell, yeah. Because all the wizards of that are actual gods. Damn, that's fucked up. Also kind of cool. Yeah, how come nothing, like, in the movies explored the fact that, like, all the wizards in that are avatars of gods? That's kind of hype. They should explore a lot more shit with Lord of the Rings, but no, it's all- we have to have Gollum go into- <laughs> well, I shan't say. <laughs> Gollum needs to go into the breeding chambers. At the very least, Magic the Gathering has actually done some of the more cool shit with, like, depicting Lord of the Rings. Mm-hmm. Mainly, I can imagine. <laughs> mainly, not everyone is white in this version of it. Hey, good. It's about time. Like the two most notable examples is like Gandalf and Aragorn. Oh, that's sick. Like especially for Gandalf, like that's actually kind of hype. Also, I love the card art for Saruman being, uh, him pondering the orb. Yep. Gandalf is apparently part of a species called the Ainur, alternatively called the Holy Ones. Because then it would take away from the then... character. Yeah. Like, like, why didn't they just fly? Why didn't they just use the eagles? Yeah. <laughs> like, there is an in-character reason why Gandalf didn't just burn people's souls away. It's, he's a good person and thinks that's too much for anyone. Yeah, it's pretty fucked up. It's also why it's such a big deal that fucking Saruman betrayed everyone, because that's a god. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm just thinking about that, like, animated uh, Lord of the Rings, which just fucking Gandalf <laughs> moving behind that door. Yeah! It's so good, it's so good. I want to do that in a D&D campaign at some point. Not a D&D Pathfinder. I'd be hyped. <laughs> I love how freaking the, the animated Gandalf just like scaring people. It is very funny. Yeah, 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 yeah. That shit's the best. <laughs> Where he, he calls Saruman Aramon in that scene. I must go now to the wizard Aramon, the head of my order. And then he just fucking like scares Pippin. For no reason. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Uh, I love, I love that like style of animation. I'm so sad it's gone. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the yeah. fucking thing of like. I gotta show you a trick. One that Mama told, told, taught me a long time ago. By the way, I'm glad you changed your last name, you son of a bitch, and just shoots the fucking wizard with a gun. That's like, hype. That's hype. That's hype. I wish I remember what that movie is called. I've seen it before. It's not that good. <laughs> but there's something just incredible about just shooting a, a wizard with a gun. So, like, the plot of that movie is the evil wizard found a bunch of, like, World War II Nazi propaganda and started following it. Oh. Mm. And the whole thing was just, like, fantasy Nazis and the fantasy post-apocalyptics are showing up. And this dude's like, that's fucked up. I'm going to shoot my Nazi brother. You know what? Yeah. The fact that it's just called Wizards? Yeah. Yeah. That, it's that, that just, just called yeah, that Wizards? Tracks. <laughs> All right. That tracks. That tracks. That tracks. Yeesh! <laughs> mm. <laughs> Ooh. A little close to home there. Spicy. <laughs> like, there's a lot of problems that movie. A lot of it uses, like, a lot of sexual stuff to make you uncomfortable. Without yeah, going into, I mean, like, too much detail. <laughs> yeah, the name the name Wizards alone and talking about, like, fash stuff is, is already a, uh, a certain combination of, of feelings I'm experiencing.
Oh, so do like, so that film creator has this problem where they know how to make comedy. They struggle with serious stuff when they're in charge of a project. Mm -hmm. So that movie cuts away the comedy gags all the time. That really breaks the tone of the movie. Damn, the Rooster Brothers worked on that too. <laughs> like I'm, 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 I'm throwing like stones at Marvel. I'm throwing stones at everyone. Let's go. We're gonna. Lord of, his Lord of the Rings movie is the most consistent movie he has, simply because he followed the, like, script of the book really hard, except for some name changes. Mm hmm Which is fine, I guess. Yeah, there's a lot of problems with the animated movie. They were really experimental. A lot of the movie seems like, oh, this seems like a cool technique, let's do it here, and then not, and then forget about it, and then do it again later. It's, like, very inconsistent. Yeah, yeah. There's sometimes movies like that. Like, I'm all down for the movie being super experimental. I just wish they, like, mm -hmm. stuck to some of the experiments. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's, it's hard to try to keep a lot of stuff experiments when you're trying to just vary it up, I guess, from scene to scene. <laughs> it's why there's a lot of scenes where it's just, like, people in costumes on top of the animation, but they have, like, this effect over them. Yeah, it's a, it's a cool-looking effect. It's very cool. The rotoscoped freaking uh... Is it called the Balor? I think that's what it is. The Bal the Something rotoscope like the rotoscoped Balor looking really awkward. I don't have a concise knowledge of Lord of the Rings. It's, it's a lot of that kind of fantasy shit. Where it's just like, oh, I see you were doing this. All right, Balrog. Leaves. That's what it is. Oh, the boxer. Let's go. Where's that uh, dictator? Which one is it? Talk about boxer or dictator. We talk about Balrog. We're gonna... <laughs> the fuck is this fucking, like, alien clown music I'm listening to? <laughs> I love alien clown music. Damn, they got Ed Sheeran in there, too. Sick. I will say, something that's definitely come up with in, a. Uh... <coughs> Magic the Gathering's new fucking set of, like, Lord of the Rings stuff. Mm -hmm. People need to, like, run more interesting shit. Everyone's just running, like, a mono-black deck that's built around the fucking Nazgul. The fucking Ring Wraiths. If I was playing, uh, MTG, I kind of wanted to run, like, a red and black deck, because, haha, funny, <laughs> anarcho-cap communism. Uh, red and black, also known as Rakdos, uh, it's currently meta. Ooh, spicy. I'm not looking much to play meta. Um, I play like kind of fucked up uh, decks in a lot of other card games. Like I'm, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a heroes player in Yu-Gi-Oh. I sometimes also play. Um, uh, what's it called? Are there any funny uh, golem builds? There are. Freaking uh, decks built around the mechanic of the set being the ring. Uh, golem is a really good engine for those. Because every golem card has an effect that makes the ring tempt you. And when your the ring tempts you, it's maxed out, its effects are insane and you can't get rid of it. That's funny as fuck. It's like every time you attack, if a creature blocked it, uh, your opponent has to sacrifice another creature. If you hit them directly, they take an extra three damage. And for attacking, you draw a card and discard one card. Mm-hmm. Are there any cards that takes your opponent to the breeding pits? You, if you want to go to the breeding pits, you need to run a freaking uh, a white, green, red deck. <laughs> Those decks have like some of the most ridiculous amount of like token spam potential. Mm. Hi, I know a lot about Magic: The Gathering right now because I've been playing it a lot. <laughs> What the fuck does it literally any of this mean? Uh, in Magic the Gathering, uh, cards are separated by the type of mana they get, and mana is uh, depicted with colors. 
Uh, there's white mana, red mana, green mana, blue mana, and black mana. Each one of them tends to have like a cohesive theme amongst all of them. Cause like there's a story in Magic the Gathering and each color like has like a uh, meaning to them. So they make spells based off of those meanings usually. Yeah, it's it's um it, it's it's Western Duel Masters. Yeah. <laughs> Here's the thing. Uh I decided to like try and get into Magic Story, mainly by starting with the first legendary creature card I ever got, which was this dude named Urabrask. Mm -hmm. Urabrask is sweet as fuck. He's like part of the villain faction called the Phyrexians, except since he's the color red, which represents freedom, he hates the rest of them. <laughs> because fuck. Uh, the Phyrexians are essentially like the Borg. They assimilate everything into their fucking group. I see. I made a joke about Duel Masters. Duel Masters is still ongoing, like, which is ridiculous to me. I can't believe that. And there's, they have like similar civilizations, there's like one less. So it's, they don't have white, but they still have like yellow, blue, black, red, and green. Which is, that's interesting shit. I haven't really played the game in like forever. As a childhood game of mine, I never was really good at that game. It's like I kind of play Yu-Gi-Oh, but I can't, I couldn't play that game that well because I didn't know what the fuck I was doing. And then I put the lamps. Also probably like... You know any like card games you saw as a kid that you just like... You're like, yeah, this is pretty cool, and just never really, like, played at all, despite trying your best to. Uh, that was Yu-Gi-Oh, 100%. Ah, I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of want to play Yu-Gi-Oh now, but I also don't. I don't think anybody knows how to play Yu-Gi-Oh. I think we're all just making it up as we go along. We're just, we're, it's like we're back at the fucking playground, just making shit up. I know how to play Yu-Gi-Oh. I'm just tired of what Yu-Gi-Oh is. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. I know a little bit about how to play Yu-Gi-Oh. Like, I play... Dragon Maids and Heroes, and I want to play those two decks. They basically play themselves. Like, I played, like, a... Freaking last time I played, I played a freaking Junk Stardust Synchron deck. Hell yeah. Because 5Ds represent. 5Ds nuts, got them. Oh. Um, anyway. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't help myself. And, uh, my deck was pretty damn good. Mm -hmm. Again, I was able to first turn put out like the strongest card of that archetype really consistently. Ooh, that's hype. And that just makes people quit because yeah, uh, that card is essentially uh, you have multiple things denying your opponent the ability to do fuck all. That's hilarious. That's hilarious. That's kind of why I like playing heroes. If I just had um, the right one set up, I could just go lol lamau. You can just not do anything because I have this card that just Make sure that your trap zone doesn't work, your spell trap, your spell doesn't work, and shit like that. Like, I love heroes. Mass heroes is mad cool. I think I only have. Like, we still had a hard time trying to get all the cards, though. I think I also splashed in like a couple destiny hero cards in the deck simply because destiny hero phoenix, or yeah, destiny hero phoenix destroyer was yeah. way too powerful to just ignore. <laughs> yeah, phoenix destroyer is fucking mad good. Like, it's it's disgusting how good that character is. I probably should have ran that a little bit more. Probably would have had a lot stronger of a deck. Um, it might be an evil hero, Phoenix Destroyer. No, it's Phoenix Enforcer, I think. Yeah. This card cannot be destroyed by battle. Yeah. I'm supposed to be about TCGs. Is that I can't do anything without triggering an effect, which requires me to eat all the cards on my side of the field or some shit. Yeah, that's the thing. Like Yu-Gi-Oh, like archetypes are so fucked up and buried, and some of them are just like obscene like some of the synchro summon shit i wanted to run a uh rose dragon deck at some point but i know those cards are fucked up those are some fucked up cards love freaking black rose dragon it's like black the coolest dragon. of the 5d dragons it's really good um i like live stream and power tool dragon design wise but uh i think yeah black rose dragon probably definitely the coolest 
wish I didn't like fucking have to be so annoying trying to get a lot of those um, cards in Master Duel because that's what that's kind of what turned me off from playing the game a lot more was just having to go through all that song in advance to get some cards is just like nah you know what fuck it fuck yeah it. I, don't, I, I don't care there's no really like good card game that's like matchmaking on market right now that I'm aware of. Uh, you know, you can just play fucking a couple other card games that are just like through certain other clients. I know the Yu-Gi-Oh! client is a really good one. It's just you just make your decks without having to go through any like song and dance with um buying shit, which is nice. What else something I really miss? Mm-hmm. I miss like card game RPGs. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I know what you mean. Like uh your battle networks and shit. Your your yeah. new hearts and shit, yeah. Freaking... I thought about going back and playing more Battle Network. There was like I one. I, I, since like Match Gathering is the thing I've been like more obsessed with lately, there was like one Match of the Gathering card RPG that was fucking awesome. It was like mm -hmm. from 1997, a game called Chandelar. Mm. That game's genuinely great. There's like no real good way to play it now. It's that sucks really bad. Also, haha, -ha, complimenting a French deck, cringe. Anyway, and, like the character in Chandelar is like idly mentioned in Arena because mm -hmm. there's like the Wanderer character that's like the thirty dollars starter thing, like the one time purchase thing in the game. Uh, the avatar you get of that is just the Wanderer, which is just like the faceless custom character from other games, which that is the character from Chandelar. That's hilarious. Did you go Duelist the Rose? Yeah, I had that game as a kid. That's a, that's yeah. a nice game. I do think it has one of my favorite lines in any piece of media ever, which is, my name is Henry Tudor, but I find that kind of tedious, so call me Yugi instead. <laughs> Funny as fuck line. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> out of, con yeah, so they're actually referencing the, uh, what was it? Like the Rose War in that game? Yeah, fucking War of Roses. <laughs> yeah, the War of Roses. So Yugi is Henry Tudor. I forget who uh, Kaiba is. Uh, that's hilarious. It's so fucking funny. Let's see, who is everybody? Uh, Henry Tudor. <laughs> yeah, Kaiba is is uh, Christian Rosencruz. Margaret, my Buford. There's some, there's some stupid shit in here. Jasper Dice Tudor. And you know, everyone's favorite character in the in the <laughs> favorite character, favorite member of the War of the uh, Rose Wars, um, Weevil Underwood. <laughs> Unaltered Weevil Underwood. Yeah, like a lot of characters in this are just unaltered, like Weevil, Joey, Keith. You Bandit Keith? <laughs> I think the funniest thing about fucking Bandit Keith in, in that game is that he's, his stupid American flag, like, headband has changed to be a Union Jack, and it's so fucking funny. <laughs> I didn't I'm know that. At fucking Axel. Yeah, it's, it's, it's on his official art. And I went to check to make sure, okay, does he have the Union Jack in the other one now? It's like, nope. It's, 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 it is a Union goddamn Jack, and it's so funny. Shoutouts to the best fucking mod for uh, Street Fighter VI that just changes the Union Jack on Cammy's thing to, uh, like, Pride Flags or the Irish yeah. flag. I think the Irish flag is the funniest one, like, genuinely. I think it's so fucking funny. What is this Paper Mario-ass music? Hell yeah, from, from fucking, what, a whack, from the, from the, fuck, what's it called, the fucking, Barely On Parents game? Yeah. Wild. It's like the fucking instrument they're choosing that makes me think of it. Mm. I have done it. I'm turning back on the Ebenezer Scrooge, uh, hold on. Oh, we're metamorphosizing. Uh, this is a wonderful house, it reminds me of my childhood, when I was like a fucking small lad. The kids beat me up for believing in Christmas and Santa was real. Now I no longer believe in Christmas. <laughs>
Remember in the movie when, like, Jesus sh showed up for, like, a day and then died in front of me? <laughs> that was actually really hype. I love that moment, actually. Yeah. <laughs> it traumatized put... me. <laughs> how do you make the worst TCG possible? Okay, um... here's how you make the worst TCG possible. Uh, your move, your, like, move economy? Infinite. You have no resources you need to do to access your moves, and you can do an infinite combo on turn one with almost every deck archetype. It... Ah, so Yu-Gi-Oh. It is Yu-Gi-Oh, yes! <laughs> okay, here's how you make a good card game. Uh, you just make Digimon card game from current year. It's good as fuck. Like, it's genuinely one of my favorite card games ever. Like, TCGs. I've been you know, going just, for just... almost three hours, what the hell? Hell yeah, you're gaming, let's go. I should probably stop to eat. <laughs> maybe, maybe. Probably if, a good idea. This is probably the last of the Ebenezer Scrooge saga, which is a really good point to stop. <laughs> yeah. You Scrooge, you lose. What the fuck is this, like, gamer tip? I don't need to take a bath. Why is the Ebenezer Scrooge the one saying it? It's either, it's one of us saying it. I like to mention Scrooge, I imagine you bathe. <laughs> if you don't bathe, what the fuck? <laughs> I do. I smell like old men. I'm scrooging it up. <laughs> yeah, that was the last Scrooge mission. Well, to be fair, Scrooge is in like what old timey Britain. Those motherfuckers didn't bathe worth nothing. Well. I am done with my 24 hours Valorant bender. 24 I must go now, chat. My gamer diaper needs to get changed, and I need to take a nap. Thank you for your time with us. It was Anything only... else you want to say? What's the deal with kids these days being more gay than I remember? Okay, bye, Scrooge. <laughs> Damn. Well, there he goes, chat. Never Damn. be seen again. Crazy, crazy. Ebenezer Scrooge on my stream. Everyone applaud. Everyone give a big round of applause for Ebenezer Scrooge. <laughs> Scroogeinist. He really Scrooged it up tonight, I will say. Sure did. Uh, I accidentally closed the media share thing instead of shrinking it. That's probably bad. Oof. I Which means fun. it's still on. I have to take care of that, so we're going to go to the ending screen. <laughs> Shoutouts to adding Finfin fin to the ending screen. I think that was a great addition on my part. Shoutouts to Finfin. Finfin fin helps you win-win, gamer. Finfin, fin, come and see. I should stop the music because my screen has music already. All right, let's let's fix my fucking thing. Thanks for the stream. And this was a great stream. Like it was mad good. <laughs> fucking Scrooge gaming. Pretty good. Where the fuck is the scene for fucking media player? Oh no. It disappeared. Oh, oh no. there it is. I found it. Okay, we found it. We found it, gamers. We did it. All right. Now I can properly turn it off. Hooray. Stop showing me. Why did it play? Why is it playing Movies Free again? Movies Free, I guess. Better get it, gamers. Get that free movie. We love getting free movies and not dying. Right, chat? We love Movies Free. Let's see who we can raid. Who, Hell yeah. Who is live at this moment, at this Who is time. currently on Twitch.tv? There's Chongo Show, aka Ryan, playing true. Viewfinder. It's true. I need to set up like a credits for my stream of like showing everyone subscribe. I think that'd be cool. 
That'd be pretty cool. I have to put mine back because I haven't set it back up since I've moved everything over from my oh, oh, to my new hard drive, so I have to probably get all that shit back. Oops. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. Goodbye. Be free like Finfin Fin on the magical planet of Teo. Be free.